Russian President Vladimir Putin said that Islamic terrorists are responsible for the deadly attack at the concert outside of Moscow last week. However, he has also hinted that Ukraine may have benefited from it and added that Kyiv may have played a role in the deadliest attack inside Russia in two decades. However, the death toll from the attack at the Crocus City Mall Hall uh, music venue has crossed 150. ISIS has claimed credit for the attack. Four people linked to the attack have also been arrested. Still with us on the broadcast is group captain UK Devna. So we were just talking about this, uh, but you know, uh, Russia, especially with Vladimir Putin in power for so many years, their strong holding has been their military. So, I mean, what exactly happened that, you know, they were unable to, um, they were unable to realize that something like this was going to take place? Uh, yes, Azavari, it has taken this attack uh, and uh, failure of Russian security services, F SFSB and uh, their uh, uh, paramilitary forces to stop this attack has taken uh, all the military and police uh, strategists all over the world by surprise. Uh, what has happened that this interrogation of these four people is now revealing that at least one of them belong to Tajikistan and one of them comes from Turkey. Now, uh, th that ISIS, uh, there was some anti-Russian uh, feeling brewing in ISIS for last some time was known. And America also had warned uh, uh, Russian authorities uh, 15 days ago that some kind of an attack was imminent during a concert. In fact, America had issued an advisory to its citizen who stay in Russia and around Moscow to avoid going to crowded areas or concert or any mall during this period. Uh, what is even more surprising is uh, during this war, these people have managed to travel, say, now it appears, all the way from Tajikistan or all the way from Turkey and infiltrate into Russia. It appears that uh, uh, certain uh, people who are staying within Russia uh, they may be of um, um, uh, they may be uh, staying in Russia, but they are sympathizers of Ukraine, and uh, maybe they have some grudge against Putin and Kremlin. So these internal sleeping cells have provided some kind of a logistics support, shelter, or uh, you know they have hidden them for some time. But still, nevertheless, it remains a big surprise that once upon a time we knew the great KGB uh, which knew uh, every uh, individual citizen in within Russia and especially the anti-Russian elements and now its uh, new avatar FSB has failed to locate these people before attack. Um, Putin definitely is making a lot of noise that Ukraine and uh, CIA has got hand behind this attack. Uh, 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 as time passes, some more evidence will come out. Russia still continues to make a very heavy um, military presence in Syria and Iraq, where it is trying to um, help out uh, the regime of um, President uh, Bashar al-Assad uh, to survive the internal rebellion by various uh, breakaway groups, various terrorist groups, in which ISIL uh, and ISIS groups are very active. So, what is the exact link of ISIS who are uh, practically now limited to a small part of Syria and Iraq and how they have managed to infiltrate all the way up to Moscow, uh, uh, details are yet to come out. Yes, Asavri? For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel, hit the bell icon.